Support the Ramen Raider on Patreon. Thanks to all our patrons. All right, hey. This is Hans, the Ramen Raider, with another episode of Instant Noodle Recipe Time. Oh, it's hot and gross in here. Uh, this is the show where I show you what to do with your instant noodles. Don't sweat them. Good God. This is Marashan Yaki Soba Orange Chicken. What? What? Yeah, it's new. It's new. I have oranges and chicken. I mean, that's got to kind of be the deal, right? We got two sachets in this one. I got the big powder. I hopefully, hopefully it's not like tang. And then we've got a garnish. So we're gonna put the garnish in on the side. Yeah, it's like really muggy here today, and I've been like cooking all this stuff in the kitchen. And yeah, I'm I'm like sweating like a, a sweaty guy. But yeah, it's alright. It's okay. It's cool. So today is the second day of August 2024. You know me, I'm doing what I do. Oh, man. Wow. I don't think it helps that I'm eating like really salty stuff too, but it's okay. It's okay. It is all right. You're gonna be fine. But uh, yeah, the weekend beckons. But yeah, it's really hot and humid here, and humidity is not something you really get in Washington State like this. It's grody. It's yucky. Ugh. Had to run out earlier so I could get some... Oh, let's try these out. A garnish option, mandarin oranges, and I have some sautéed chicken as well. I'm hoping these aren't just, like, gigantic. They're not. Perfect. I don't know that I've ever had a canned orange. Have you? Yeah, baby. Look, look, it's a new day, oranges. Look at the light of the day. I guess I'll use a spoon. Is that indicated here? Let's try one of these. It's in syrup. That seems kind of weird. Cool, though. These are the size I was hoping they would be. Oh wow, that makes me think of like school lunch. Big time. Not very good. <laughs> but they'll work in a pinch, alright? Yeah, I am. This is the third one I'm doing. I am ready to be done. For the first one, I did the cheddar yakisoba, and I had to bake, uh, I put a slice of sourdough in the oven at 200 degrees for like an hour. That was probably overkill. But it made it bone dry, so I could use it as a uh, uh, breadcrumb topping. And then, so there was that. I had to saute some chicken, I had to make chili. So the kitchen is really gross. The AC doesn't seem to be really addressing the kitchen at all. But I'll be out of here momentarily and I'm happy about that. Actually, no, I won't. I gotta make the kids their lunch. Then I gotta make my wife her lunch. But actually, I think I'm gonna give my daughter that cheddar cheese one. She'll, she'll be thrilled about that. So yeah, I don't need any lunch. I had some of that chili cheese one the last episode. That was good, actually. That worked. The bummer about that one was the cheese itself. It did melt, but it didn't really look like it. It, yeah, so. 
but it worked. Um, that's a thing you could eat. <laughs> the pictures came out good, I think. So that'll be pretty epic. And after this, it'll be tomorrow, Saturday. We are going to go visit the uh, fire station. Miles is really big into fire trucks and all that jazz. So he goes on Google Maps. He goes on Street View and drives all around this area looking for fire stations. It's kind of cool. Hey, he's not on the street slinging meth. Don't knock it. <laughs> I don't know though. It's like they've got their tablets now. That now they're really into their uh, Chromebooks. Like really into their Chromebooks. But he likes to do all sorts of crazy business. So that's cool. In one minute, I'll be stirring noodle with this. I'm so curious if it's just going to be like like tang. I have a feeling it's not. I'm hopeful. If it's got that way over fake sweet acidic thing going on, I will be bummed. But the cheddar seemed like noodles with cheese, which seemed like mac and cheese. The chili cheese one definitely tasted like like chili cheese Frito flavor in a noodle, in a sauce of noodles. So this, this might be good. I have a feeling it's gonna probably taste like the sauce for uh, Panda Express or something. They seem to be getting, Mar Marishan in particular, seems to be pretty good with their, uh, their uh, flavor profiles, at least how they present them in the US. Put your face right over the tray. Or not. <laughs> yeah. I am. I am very thankful to the, the folks at Marshawn for sending these varieties over. However, I'm really glad to be done doing this for today. Very glad. All right. Yeah, I'm not gonna, I don't want to get this stuff all over the place. As my mom always said, you make a mess. You just make a mess. I don't want to make a mess. Whoa. I'm getting a scent. Oh, we'll see what happens. All right. Let's stir. Look out of the ordinary. Okay. So we got chicken and little orange thingies, and I got some scallion. So I figure it's worth a shot. Let's see how it is. I'm really curious. Orange chicken, huh? Give it a try. I get it. Kind of a chicken and citrus thing going on. It's definitely a different, different one. There's so many different varieties that they've come out with. Like jalapeno cheddar and tomato and basil. I'd like to try that one again, even though that was like 10 years ago, I'm pretty sure. Let's give it another, another sampling. There we go. There's a piece of veg. Hmm, cabbage? I don't know what's going on here. It must be cabbage. Interesting. Well, 
how is it? It's not bad. I mean, if you like orange chicken, I don't know that I've ever really gone like, man, I'm in the mood for orange chicken. I've heard people that are like all over the place about it, that they really enjoy the uh, orange chicken. So, it looks kind of orange. Come on, Trey. Slowly, slowly the noodles found their way onto the plate. That's pretty good. Okay, I think this could move this way a little bit. I really like this plate, but it can be a pain in the butt. We do have chicken. Hmm. All right, this is gonna be interesting. Orange. That would work well for a little bit of crisp. I think that's about as far. Ah, uh, sesame seed. Wow, I better get moving. The natives are going to get restless. Well, there you go, orange chicken. There's oranges and there's little chicken. A little chicken. Chicken and little oranges. Okay. Come on, Rotato. Duh. Oh, that's what it's doing. Rotate. wishing you enjoyment your noodles each and every day go on hit that like button hit that subscribe button I really really appreciate it when you do uh, there'll be more cool stuff coming along your way soon so uh, stay tuned have a good one bye bye 
The eggs are boiling, they are oval. The eggs are boiling, golden and ramen. The eggs are boiling, soft and jammy. The eggs are boiling, the eggs are boiling, the eggs are boiling. Who will cry for the chicken? Who will eat these eggs?